Well, Connecticut's top lawman is declaring victory tonight in the state's battle against so-called ghost guns. Those are the illegal, untraceable weapons that have no serial numbers and are more and more frequently turning up on our streets and being used to commit crimes. State Attorney General William Tong announced today a settlement with a gun part manufacturer in Utah, AR Industries. They're dissolving their online presence and have agreed to stop selling those parts here. Ghost guns are extraordinarily dangerous. When I was in the legislature, uh, I helped to write the ghost gun ban that later became law after I became attorney general. But the reason why they're so dangerous is because these ghost gun manufacturers and retailers sell kits that are roughly 80% of a firearm. And then people receive these kits. They, they then do the 20% more, which isn't hard, you know, with a, a little bit of basic tooling and a YouTube account, you can make the full gun. And we're not just talking about handguns or plastic guns or 3D printed guns. We're talking about AR-15s. We're talking about assault rifles. Well, if the company is caught selling those kits or violating any part of the settlement, they face a penalty of $205,000.